I'm, I'm, I'm not you, you're Sam. I'm me, I'm Sam. I'm from late of the pier. And, and we're um, in Sydney in Field Day. Yeah, we're right here in Field Day in the middle of Really the bright jungle. light. <laughs> A really small jungle in the middle of Sydney. But we, it's got bats, so it technically is some sort of jungle. And uh, it's got nice trees. We want to see in the tree, but they wouldn't let us. Happy accident is how we made a band. Hello. Um, I don't know, we were just kind of bored of school. So we started messing about with music. And that makes you a band, apparently. The really interesting thing for Australians is that I came out here when I was like quite a young teenager. And that was before I was in a band or anything. And uh, it's quite a sentimental story, but I actually kind of like this place so much that I thought, how on earth am I going to get the opportunity to come out here again in the future? And I realized that being a musician would be actually be a really good way of getting out here. So part, it, it, Australia is partly to do with me being a musician altogether. <laughs> but I thought I was going to be a busker at first. <laughs> I thought, I'll come out here and I'll busk outside shops. Like, I'll take a little guitar amp and do that. But we're doing a bit more than busking, I suppose. Not really. No, <laughs> no OK. The name, where did it come from? It came from beyond. It came from deep down in the darky, murky waters of... Castle the, Doddington. <laughs> yeah. I the, don't know. We found it written hole. on a box. Uh, we found a really interesting box. We opened it and inside it's just lay the pier. So We're not going to give you a straight answer because we don't there know. isn't one. <laughs> like, we always try and kind of explain to people that there's not a meaning and they, they don't like that. People want there to be a meaning behind it. And um, one day somebody will probably like figure out that it means something really deep and we'll be like, wow. I think we, we're the kind of band that wants to keep it quite intimate though. Like busking is almost what we're doing because we're trying to kind of please a very small number of people quite close to us usually. We're not very good at festivals because we kind of like get a bit deluded by thousands of people. Um, so it's cool, today we were in front of like maybe 200, 200 who were really like watching us and a few that were walking past trying to get to other parts of the festival. But that suited us fine. <laughs> People often think that we're drunk on stage. They usually get that idea because the stage is usually covered in stuff that we spilt. And so we, we're always slipping about. Like today, when I ran over to the mic, I just <laughs> slipped straight past it, but managed to grab it and sort of like oh, hang scream on. into it at the start of the verse for our last song. So they, I'm not surprised they think we're like hammered. The end of Fucker, I tried to go absolutely nuts and I was just sliding back and forth all over the place. It's fun though. The highlights for us over the last year have been Japan yeah. and this place. I think they're both going to go down in our memories as being just unbeatable. You know, you, I think it's when you tell stories to people back home in England and you just can't describe why yeah. it's so good. Ooh. 